In today's video, we're going to be trying Blackstone Steakhouse and Grill here in Mississauga, Ontario, Canada. Is it any good? Let's find out. So Blackstone here in Mississauga is halal and uh, yeah. Okay, so let's first try their rib eye. So it's from the black stone itself. So it just took it off. Ooh, that was a really clean cut. And it's still medium rare. You can see the pink inside. Mmm, that's super good. You can cook it more on the black stone itself if you want. But let's get a cross section. Ooh, it's a... Mmm, wow, it's super flavorful. Um, it's soft, it's tender, the beef is so good, and you have these herbs that just add to the flavor of the, the beef. It's actually really good. If you want it more well done, you could just put it back on the grill. Okay, so now let's try the jerk nachos. There's a var variety of um, corn tortilla chips, and then there's also like cheese with uh, jerk chicken on top. So let's try it out. That's so good. The chips are super fresh, they're super crunchy. And then the jerk chicken adds so much flavor to it. It's salty, it's peppery, super flavorful. There's a taste of garlic sauce, and then the cheese is really cheesy. Let's try with the queso. That's so good. But these nachos are so good, they're like homemade chips. So good. They taste a little bit like shawarma. With a little bit of garlic sauce. Okay, quick intermission. Let's try the kids' meal penne but, uh, with butter. Uh, it has a lot of cheese. It's okay. I think the pasta could be cooked a little bit more. It's still a little chewy to my preference, but it's okay. But the penne uh, butter, it's really uh, cheesy. There's Parmesan on that and just normal mozzarella. Next up, we got this 10 ounce strip loin. Let's cut into the middle. Oh yeah, that's still medium rare. It's still pink, still juicy. Oh, this one's a lot more juicy and tender, but it has less flavor than the 12 ounce ribeye. I think it would taste better if it was just like a little bit longer on the grill. There's less herbs on this one. It was still pretty good. Okay, now let's try the Caesar salad. Uh, I came on with the both, both of the steak. Normal Caesar salad with lettuce, cheese, and we have croutons. The croutons are soft, but yeah, it's still pretty good size. Okay, let's try the mashed potatoes that also comes with the steak. Um, yeah, it has the gravy on this side. Mmm, super creamy, um, super soft uh, texture. I really like that mashed potato. It's buttery, creamy, and then you have uh, like green spring onion on top. Pretty good, I like it. But I think I like the ribeye more than the strip loin. Now let's try this, um, the hot sauce that comes with both of the steaks. I forgot to try it. It adds so much flavor, this, the hot sauce. Let's try this, um, this orange sauce. I'm not sure what it is. Oh, it's some space, spicy mayo, but it's not as spicy as that red sauce, the hot sauce. It's super good. I like it. Okay, now let's try the burger. This is the six ounce beef cheeseburger. Uh, it comes with fries. Let's try it out first. Ooh, the fries are super crispy. I'm pretty sure they're fresh. And this mayo. It's pretty good. I like it. Now let's try the burger itself. They're supposed to be... They're supposed to be... Uh, Cold beef brisket inside, and then there's a six ounce patty, and then there's cheese, there's mayo. Let's try it out. That's really good. So, like the beef itself is really soft, and then you have the cheese on top, the melted cheese. Very good. I didn't get any of the pulled beef. Let's try to get some of it. So, the pulled beef on top adds a lot of texture. The flavor is already there from the beef patty itself. It's pretty flavorful. You have lettuce, cheese, and then um, you have all these, all the sauces inside. It's a really creamy, flavorful burger. So the buns, they're, I think they're just normal sesame hamburger buns, but the beef, super flavorful. And then you have the onions to add a little bit of crisp. It's pretty good, I like it. 
So overall, I think Blackstone is a pretty good steakhouse here in Mississauga. It's halal. It's, I think, the same uh, price as other steakhouses. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe, leave a like. I'll see you next one. This is your boy Foodie, saying out. Peace.